now. Shweta, um, imagine that there is someone who is watching us, mm -hmm. has absolutely no idea how to get a visa, mm -hmm. but this person has got admission in one of the schools. What he or she should do now? Okay. The first thing when we understand that we are going abroad for France and for education purpose, the most common term we heard is Campus France. Right. So next question comes in mind is what Campus France is? So Campus France is a body, it's an organization which is very helpful in the process from visa till your admission and going to France. Right. You're traveling, till traveling. It works in two process. First is Campus France, you have to create an account on Campus France portal. Okay. The, the second thing is you have to fill a form which says that you are a student and you have been accepted in an institution. Okay. And and ahead of that, when you complete all the process, you have a unique registration number from Campus France. Mm -hmm. That says that your account has been validated. Right. And you can go ahead with the second process. Okay. okay. The second process is like after receiving that unique registration number, you have to mail it to the Campus France office, okay. nearest Campus France office, according to your feasibility. Okay. which is really very important right so you get a your whole motto to do all this is to get an noc from campus france office okay after getting an noc you are good to go to the next step which is vfs okay after getting the noc from campus france okay we have three main steps to follow okay okay first we need to go to the vfs website okay so you need to go on that website you need to select france visa you need to create an account over there with your application number which you have got from NOC letter in Campus France. Right. Okay. Right. You have to put that to fill in the details like uh, which visa you are requiring. Okay. In the case of people who are coming to France for masters or studying, so it's a long stay student visa. Okay. Mm -hmm. You need to submit that and you need to take an appointment. Most uh -huh. of In most of the cases people find a day after or two days after okay second step is collection of all the documents that you need to submit to VFS okay and we need to be very mindful because what all documents we are submitting with our passport yeah none of the document will get back to us only the passport will come back most important part over there is cover letter okay cover letter should be very precise and it should cover everything sure from which date you are traveling uh -huh. what is which city you are landing uh -huh. Uh, what is your air ticket you have to put in there? What is your purpose of visit? Why you have chosen a particular course, particular college and who is funding you? After that, uh, academic documents, photocopy, you need to submit your financial documents. Mm -hmm. Approved bank approval letter is enough for financials, okay. which I have shown. Plus accommodation for minimum three months you need to show. Okay. Okay. Plus if you are 26 years old, mm -hmm then you need a health insurance of only three months okay if you are more than 26 year old then you need a health insurance of one year uh -huh. one affidavit from your parents if they are your guarantor that's a guarantor document ah uh, okay 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 the third and final step is the day you have to go to vfs center and submit all the documents you just need to present all the documents to them once that is done they will prepare a file mm -hmm. they will put it into that they will give it to you with a receipt that you need to pay 6500 rupees after the payment mm -hmm. you need to go to the biometric fingerprinting will be done okay the photo will be clicked okay okay so after this process is done you are good to go and after like few days, you'll receive one message that your file has been processed to embassy. And once the passport will be dispatched, mm -hmm. you will again get a mail and message. So you're not mm -hmm. going to consulate. No, you're not we are going not to going to, to consulate. We are not going to embassy. We are not giving any interview to any consulate or any embassy. Wow. So the only person you don't want to disappoint is Campus France guys, because if they don't give you NOC, you're not coming to France, I feel. Yes. How long did the whole process took for you? After submitting the file, it took eight days for me. For you, Shweta, how long did it take to get a visa in your hand, starting from the day you opened your account in Campus France till the time you have the passport with the mm -hmm. visa stamp in that? So everything took place in 20 working days. All right, guys. So thank you so much for coming on my channel. I uh, hope you guys got the whole point. Um, and yeah, if you enjoyed it, hit that thumbs up button. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.